Okay, so we've got to get into this fully rested and um, we got to get into this because it looks like the return of Jekka Craig. Let's just put Rose Hanbury to a corner. Let's discuss Jekka Craig and what the groundworks are being set up for. Hey guys, this is Rob Morali. Hopefully you guys are all doing well today. Back in again with another video. If you have not subscribed, click that button, guys. It is daily and consistent content. Comment down below. Give this video a thumbs up. I would appreciate it. And let's get straight into this, where it looks like Eden, Kate Middleton's best friend, let's just say, you know, close to James Middleton, the Daily Mail reporter, is setting the groundwork up in this very odd article that's come out today which is expressing how will princess kate be well enough to attend jekka craig's <clears throat> cousin's wedding they know what they're doing by mentioning jekka craig um for those of you who don't know who she is um anderson recalls um particular individual that a journalist that whilst kate was dating william the press relentlessly continued to tie him to other beautiful women and it was upsetting but it was william's ex-girlfriend jacka craig who continued to be a thorn in kate's side because he refused to end the friendship with his ex he wasn't exactly the most sensitive boyfriend to kate and spent part of a summer vacation in craig's home country of kenya without bringing his girlfriend with him he attempted a third trip but according to a saint andrew source via an expert obtained by she knows kate was tired of being threatened and humiliated by her boyfriend and his friendship with his ex so this was all going on prior to even rose hanbury even came into the fold this was you know him not being sensitive he doesn't care william does what he wants doesn't really put his wife first and of course all of that she probably gets tired of the stuff now it's been reported that they're setting it up for princess kate not attending that wedding because she's not going to be well enough again and not being seen in places left right and center and that Prince William, the supportive husband, is still going to go to his ex's cousin's wedding without her, despite the fact that he doesn't even, that she has issues with them even being friends, the fact that he's still friends with her, but she, every, the media wants to convince you that he's so supportive of his wife. So this whole situation is going to be very interesting because of, they're setting it up for Kate Middleton not attending this event. She won't be attending this event because she's still unwell, we have still yet to see her. The Getty Images note went viral of the video being AI basically, but because she's dealing with cancer, a lot more people are more sensitive now and are not going to call out the palace and the establishment for what is going on so i find this story to be very interesting that jekka craig's in the fall i'm not saying that he's going over there to do things with her i doubt that i believe she's married anyways she has a husband i mean that doesn't stop them anyways at this point but why are you going to your ex's cousin's wedding without your wife and it's your ex and your wife is currently still ill and she's apparently got cancer and it's an international scandal and she was blamed for the photo editing stuff why are you still going why were you not there when she was filming the video do you not see how these patterns add up guys it's absolutely insane that even the press are setting it up for kate middleton to still be ill she was confirmed by the uk press to return at that easter event she was not there she did not attend she did not come and now it looks like she still has yet to be seen as far as i'm concerned i want to be corrected i want to have seen her at some event where we're like okay this is kate she's good she's well she's being papped left right center wearing the nice outfits that she does but I'm not seeing any of that right now and I just find it to be absolutely insane. It is purely royal madness what is going on that they're setting this up as the next narrative for will Princess Kate be well enough to attend at Jekka Craig's cousin's wedding? Why is, it, why is William even going, bro? That's your ex's family. Cut that shit off. You're married. You have kids. Move on. What is the need for you to go to, you know, his your ex's family's house in Kenya, your ex's family um, and, you know, wedding and be friendly with their cousins? It just, it's, it sounds like to me the man is very stubborn, does what he wants, doesn't put his wife first not really surprised at this point guys not surprised in any capacity make of this what you will guys charles took craig's side and reportedly told his older son you mustn't put her through that william it isn't fair to jack up well what about kate she didn't seem disturbed that her boyfriend was in a love triangle she just wanted craig out of the picture one way or another and that's what charles ultimately did for kate it's a complicated beginning for kate and william but probably one that charles didn't want to see play out again he had already lived it with camilla and princess diana she knows.com is obviously reporting when it comes to what was going on with prince william's love right love life i wasn't even involved in this whole jacka craig girl like i was not even privy to who this person is in terms of the past and the troublesome and the fact that he's still going to the wedding and all this weird stuff i wasn't even privy to this i was too focused on rose hanbury when really and truly when you find one you might find a few others subscribe or comment down below give this video a thumbs up i would appreciate it subscribe to the channel and i'll catch you guys soon for another video